Before I start saying anything about my mom, be your ears, I'm more than just a hive. That, that, that's my mother. In my mind, my spirit, my body, and everything. She is my mother and I'm her son. Whether she likes it or not. I'm your son and I love you. You inspire me. You make me get up every time and want to do something big out of this world. There's something that she said that you can't be something that you don't. And that you don't, be, I think she meant you, you don't believe you are. You have to tell your truth. You have to speak your truth. I mean, that was so inspiring. It made me get up from the bed. I wanted to switch off the, 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 the documentary, but I had to finish it. So I didn't switch it off. You are amazing. What you did there, so inspiring to a lot of black girls. Everyone. I like the fact that she had, she gave so many, so many people an opportunity there. 200 dancers. That's a lot. And the, the black in different sizes, shapes, and every. They were so amazing. There was. Girl, I need some of the dances now, but I, you know, <laughs> so someday, you know, doing the bodies down like girl, I got notes, guys. But before I, I, I read these notes from the whole documentary, I have to pull. You know, the power, the power my mom, Beyonce, has when she stood there. No, 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 it didn't start there. Let me, let me know the drums. No, it started with the drums. She's not there yet. And the drums are like, Boom boom a boom 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 there was dope and then they all loop and then she comes with a huge dress there was not hair there was there was some goddess out of this world there was some there was God there was God that that had everything everything about that the walk the the stick she had and she, she does this, you know, like, uh, dun, 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 dun. and then the drum, there was, okay, I cannot spend that moment, I cannot spend that moment, but what you did there, it's called queen. And then when she comes back, when she changed her dress, there's something that she does when she just stands and looks at everyone. Forget about people's reaction. I was like there too, on my phone, watching. I was like, Beyonce, Beyonce, but there's something that she possesses when she stands there. Like, there's something that she does. I don't know. The, the power, that, that blackness, the beauty, that, that energy that she possesses something. I just want to get up, open my own recording company, and do some. I, I, I'm not a good I sing. I'm not a good singer, but, but I, I see myself there. You know, like she's. She does something when she just stay. I mean, I, I, if I was rich, I would pay Beyonce to just come and stay at me. Just look at me. Now be dead. You're here on my obituary that I died because Beyonce just stood and looked at me. She's. There's something that she does when she just stands there. There was historic, iconic, and dope. And when she starts saying, Coachella, you're ready. How <laughs> can we end ready? I was gonna die. You know. I always say, when I didn't win tickets to Beyonce's concert, The Global Citizen, I always say there was a blessing in disguise. Because guys, I cried when I was streaming it on YouTube. Imagine being in the same place with them. I was going to die. I don't think I'll, I'll make it if I see I, I'm not saying I don't want to see her, but guys, I don't think I'll make it. There will be the death of me and there will be such a beautiful death. That's how I want to die, by seeing Beyonce. Are you ready? And then it's boom, boo, 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 boo. history in the history in the I like how Beyonce speaks in existence. Like she knew she was about, or well she knew that she was about to make history, and she made history, the best performance of all time. Bay Chen. There's a point where she stands there and she sings freedom. I just feel I, I felt so black. Like I wanted to get up and you know scream that I'm black. I'm black. Which is I'm black. Like there are so blackful. Blackful and amazing. And then she sang the national anthem. After singing the national anthem wait 
You had the de de ah. <laughs> let me tell let me tell you something. I, I left the phone and I wanted to do the whole call. I was like, yo, hey, let's go, guys. Beyonce rehearses. She rehearses like stop that Illuminati ish drugs, whatever you all say. She rehearses the stuff. Three months. I mean, after giving birth, when she got home, she started rehearsing. Four months rehearsing the whole dance, four months, and then the whole music stuff. That's that's a lot. She says something that she said. People don't do not want to rehearse anymore because you have to be humble, and that's the fact. That's girl, you you, you speak some fact. She spit some shit there. I like how she acknowledges everyone, the dancers, the people who work. I like how she addresses them. Everything that she does, this, the excitement, imagine making Beyonce happy when they dance there, then she comes and join them. The excitement, the happiness, imagine making Beyonce laugh. <laughs> it's, it's crazy guys. I love, I love how all the dancers are happy. They're all happy. Some don't even want to go home and it's crazy. I wouldn't want to go home. I want to sleep with Beyonce you know, every day, every week. Because she's amazing. She's Oh my god, guys, like she's yo. That was dope. And there's a part where she prays. I love how she so she shows us her vulnerable side. How because everything happens through God. She doesn't just wake up and just be like, I'm Beyonce, you gotta go and perform. She takes her time, she prays, she respects her craft, she respects everyone. I respect her, I love her, I love you Beyonce so much, I love her. She did that, <laughs> I love her goofy side, the goofy side was so amazing. Like, I got notes, I, I have to tell you something, that suck, man, booze. That was crazy guys. And she said something, She was. I think she was. She, her mic was off during that time. And she was like, I'm the bitch. I know she was about to fuck it up from there. Fuck it up, then leave and fuck. Did you see how she did the top of verse? When she was about to say the top of verse. Only icons do that. Only icons do that. And then she also told us that it was very important to her to bring the black culture to the culture. And girl, did she not? Did she lie? Where, where were the lies? Where were the lies? That was very iconic. She sacrificed the time and energy to be with her kids after giving birth. And she took the time and gave it to, the, to this performance. Amazing. The best performance of all time, if I'm not mistaken. I'm not. I know I'm not. And she told us she had gained 218 pounds. We saw her exercising the J on his side, you know giving her the stretch and stuff and she tells us sometimes she wouldn't feel her body some she was there but her spirit and her body wasn't there during the time there was a time she wanted to give up thank you for not giving up thank you for teaching her you don't stop you don't give up at all she had like four months of practicing dance four months of practicing rehearsing the whole thing that's a lot and it shows you should be very dedicated and 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 be passionate about something, what you do, what you love. That's what she loved, that's what she does. She's been waiting for this her whole life, her whole career, her whole 21 years of career. When Beyonce tells you to sing, let me warn you to everyone who goes and see her and the concert, sing. Sing your lungs up. Whether you are about to lose it, it's the last one. Sing when she, when she says sing. Sing! You gotta sing. She did the diva dance. And when she did everybody mad, I was up on my knees and legs. I was like... She, she also shows us the twin and how she'll bring him to the rehearsals. And I like how she played that uh, the other one of the dancers said when she explained that she also just had given birth and she wants her son to see this and be proud of her. And that's so beautiful. I love that. I mean, she almost died giving birth. Seeing her waking her up from there and coming and prove herself once again that she's Beyonce and she's the king, the goddess that she is. I, I was I was just inspired. I'm here complaining. I don't have money. I don't have this. 
you gotta wake up I'm, I'm really you have to wake up and do your thing i had to wake up and do this video for you that was really iconic and she has blamed during the whole time of losing weight and you know getting in shape and making this so perfect she had, she didn't have to eat carbs no sugar no meat no fish and no alcohol she's so beautiful guys the whole time you see her without makeup who does that and i like how she explained she had to pick each and every dancer she had to pick all the costumes solange is there she had to tell them how the pyramid should be those steps how the shape should be how it should stand she's in she's on every stage she rehearses and she's helping others she's checking everything only a queen does it i mean uh, if you're not inspired by this documentary i don't know i don't know guys i don't know i really do not know her vocals when she's when she sings i told you how you help me baby but you don't care hey. that was very iconic after all that dancing and you still deliver like that no when she picks the lunch day when the destiny child is there it takes me back on my old days when i was a kid when my sister sings the songs and i'm looking at her and i want to dance like her you know that's how i started learning how to dance if you know what i'm saying <laughs> i've been a big fan just to you know and i like the code that she gives us when she tells us you know my angelo it was it my angelo but those codes when she said you have to live the truth tell the truth that's dope that's really dope. Then Solange is there, Destiny Child is there, Jay is there. Did you see the audience when Jay came? That was iconic because no one expects that. That was really dope. That's crazy. I mean, when she stopped, she didn't stop when she was performing and saw the girl wearing the outfit. When, when she gave the guy a, a, a towel after, you know, in her face. Oh, damn. Is he still alive? Are you good, my nigga? Because I would have died a long time ago. That was really iconic, guys. And Blue sang the national anthem. Our queen, the next supreme. You better work on the steps, girl. I saw you rehearsing there. I'm like, girl, I got you. I've been doing this shit for years, for time. We gotta, we gotta collab with something. She sang Love on Top for us. Beyonce, I love you. And I know you're gonna see this video and you won't say anything, but you have to know that I love you. It inspired me a lot since I was a kid. There's something that you do that just boosts my confidence that made me do this video when I, I don't know how many things you killed and how many people say it. I don't know. I don't know how people are. But if you see this, I love you so much. You inspire me a lot. You inspire me to do greater things, to try and take the risk and be what I want to be. You inspire me to live my truth. And I hope that one day I do something that will be written on history books and be all over inspired even some more kids some more people the next generation and what you do is just so amazing you really said by them itches and we are bowing down to you you are the queen the king the goddess the god it's so beautiful and i love you so much i don't know how much is i how should i explain this Let's fuck up Coachella. And, and she did! She did! You did fuck it up, right? I love you. I love you so much. And you inspire me a lot. That's, that's all I'm just gonna say. I mean, I still gotta take some few notes down. You know, learn those things. And listen to the album. Do some videos. and Because I, I know all the current now. I just gotta, you know, you know, set it up. Get someone to hold this camera for me. Because I'm alone in this shit. I'm alone. I love you and you are amazing. Homecoming by Beyonce. This is my reaction on it. And this is episode 3 of my show. See you. Netflix, honey! Get me a show! Something! I've been the lawyer! Lawyer, 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 like a lawyer customer. Get me a show or something. Netflix, I see you. With the ones. With and it's Bayflix now, right? It's Bayflix. Yes. Take over B.